for a nonpartisan redistricting commission here in North Carolina. North Carolina lawmakers have introduced half a dozen bills all aimed at fixing the state's gerrymandered maps. But so far, none of them have ever gotten so much as a vote. Yet, lawmakers remain hopeful. Do you think that there's any door open for that opportunity here in the future? The simple answer is yes. But I think if we set up a commission that's bipartisan in nature, I think we can end up with a better process. Do you think there's any future for independent redistricting? Huh? I've said uh, repeatedly that uh, we are open to anything that is an improvement in the process. Republican leader David Lewis stopped short of saying he'd support a nonpartisan commission. But we asked lawmakers who do support the idea why they're hopeful it might happen now. Greensboro Republican John Hardister says it's because both sides are tired of the never-ending legal fight. No matter what happens with one lawsuit, there, there's going to be another. And it doesn't matter which party has a majority, lawsuits won't go away. Winston Salem Democrat Derwin Montgomery says it's because it avoids any possible payback. Because if the chambers switch, we're going into a new time for redistricting, and that would allow then for it not to be as harsh uh, on the other side if Democrats took, took over. I think it's in their interest to do it as well because no one knows ultimately where the power is going to shift. Most lawmakers you ask say they support the idea of a nonpartisan redistricting commission, but so far that bipartisan support has not produced a thing. In Raleigh, I'm Bill O'Neill, WXII 12 News.